Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. My name is Howard. And my name is Andrea. And we are here today with an unboxing from Universal Yums. And this is probably one of our favorite subscription boxes, especially around this time of the year, because it is basically celebrating holidays around the world. And so this month, um, they are visiting 11 different countries and you get to eat seasonal treats and eats from those particular countries. This subscription box is $25 a month. We have a lot of different snacks here, so we're gonna jump in. Oh, and I wanted to mention, I forgot, this booklet that comes with the box, it gives you a description of all of the different snacks that are in the box, as well as um, trivia questions, and it even has several different recipes in it as well. So, all right, you ready? Okay, sure. First up is... Uh, <laughs> is what? This one. <laughs> it is a sugar and anise uh, pulverone. Um, I think I said that right. It says it is from Spain, and it says this dusty delicacy Ooh. will make a lot more sense. Oh, one taste in this dusty delicacy will make a lot more sense. I don't think I like it, but... Well, it says it's extra oh, crumbly. It, yes, it fell apart, so it broke, but this is what it looks like. It just looks like a like a spice cookie. Yeah, but it's broken. Yeah. Um, and it says, um, imagine getting dust for Christmas and being excited about it. No. That's that's how they describe this <laughs> treat right here. Uh, so no thank you. And have a this, I probably don't like it. Okay. But I'll try it. It says shortbread with powdered sugar and topping. Okay. Cheers. Cheers. Okay. Is no, that anise? Mm-hmm, licorice type oh. tasting. Uh, no, <laughs> I did not know that's what that was. I don't like it either. I don't like it. I'm with you on that one. If you like, <laughs> if you if you like licorice, <laughs> you would probably like that. Don't, I don't like licorice, like black licorice type, yeah. Yeah, that's what it tastes like, black licorice. Okay, so the next thing up, get that taste out of my mouth. <laughs> Roast turkey and stuffing potato chips. Sounds interesting. It is a UK holiday feast in every in every chip. That's how they describe it. Um, roast turkey, crispness, warm spiced stuffing, and even a touch of gravy. Okay. Um, you gotta get this taste out. Cheers. Mm -hmm. mm -mm. Nope. That's a no. It's Got the, the taste out though. Got the taste went out. Got that taste out. It's the texture. It we doesn't taste. taste. It doesn't taste like a. It doesn't have the texture of like a Lay's potato chip or a kettle chip. It tastes um, not even like a Pringle. It tastes like a what is that? Cardboard. <laughs> <laughs> Never tasted it? cardboard, but uh, no. Wow. What? what? <laughs> we, Never, Never tasted cardboard, but uh, no. I, I don't think I like that one. Okay, well, I, I can't describe the texture. It's it's an odd texture, an odd flavor. Okay, so okay. up next is it's from Taiwan. Yes, I don't think I'm gonna like this one either. It is salted egg yolk popcorn. Ooh, yummy. And it says, on the Lunar New Year, locals eat soy sauce soaked tea eggs. Nope. Oh, and there's actual egg yolks in here. How does All it right. smell? What does it smell like? Uh, Does it smell like egg? I wouldn't say that, but I don't know. It, 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 it uh, I heard yolk, egg yolk. Do you uh, want to take one for the team? I'll take one for the team. Okay. How is it? A little sweet. <laughs> and. <laughs> you could like popcorn. I mean. It doesn't taste very eggy or anything, but yes, it's in my mind. But it could be egg. I don't want any. <laughs> well, I, I, I definitely don't want to try it now. I'll skip this one. We'll take his word for it. Oh man, come on, try something new. <laughs> okay. Better. Okay. So the next one up is mocktail bonbons, and it says, okay. um, if you're English and 18 years or older, um, probably one of your favorite things to do is to head to the pub. And so in this bag, 
There is Tequila Sunrise, Cranberry Cosmo. I don't think there's... I don't know, they're little thingies. You wanna let them see what's in there? They're them? different, actually different colors too. Um, Prosecco. Oh. See, I mean, there's a lot of different things, but I don't think there's actual alcohol in here. I'm reading the ingredients, that's what I'm doing. There's no actual alcohol, but it's um, colored with turmeric and beet powder and paprika. All right, let's try. Cheers. Oh, it's hard, I mean. Oh, you know what? It's Wait, sour. When I got a sour, it has a texture of a Mentos. If you've ever had a Mentos, that's the texture of it. I don't know what flavor I'm eating. I don't either. I, um, it's tangy. Sour. I actually like it. You like sour. Yeah, I do like sour. The texture of a Mentos or a Starburst or something like that. At least it's got the other flavors out of my mouth though. Yeah, those other flavors are horrible. Okay. But I uh, have a hole in my mouth. <laughs> have a, get rid of it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. <sighs> Sorry. Excuse me. Okay. <laughs> that cannot stay. That is not staying in here. Here it is, come on. No. Okay. Okay, okay, what's next? Okay, so next up, we have a cookie from the Netherlands. Okay, I, I hope this is it's, better. It says crude, I think it's crude note and cookies. Okay. Um, basically, it is a spice cookie. A Dutch spice cookie, kind of like a specula, as it said. Ooh, okay, a little cookie. Yeah, it's a cute little cookie. Cheers. Right, cheers. This is a spice cookie. Yeah, no, this one is good. Very crunchy. Not special, it kind of reminds me of gingerbread. Yeah, but it does, I don't taste the ginger in it. It, it really does taste like a Biscoff cookie. That's kind of what it, tastes like and reminds me of. So, okay. pretty good, I like that. So next up, we have Alpine Nut Cake. It says a crumbly nutty pie straight from the Swiss Alps. Okay. Um, it has caramelized walnuts and hazelnuts, um, and it says it's sweet. And it says that, oh. That's not what I expected, huh? Not at all, how many do you get in there? Just one, that's it. Okay, and it says Swiss folks um, eat this in January. Oh, it has a... It has stuff on the end. I'm not a filling person. You like fillings. I do. I don't. Okay. We'll see. I'll cut you a little piece and I okay. get a bigger piece maybe. They look the same size. Yours is a little, a little smaller. Oops. Okay. Cheers. Cheers. Not bad. It's good. The texture is kind of like the inside of a brown sugar pop tart. You don't eat pop tarts. Brown sugar tart. I don't know, but it tastes good. That's all I know. It's okay. Mm. It's okay. It's a uh, the cake part of it was kind of dry, but yes. the like a cookie, more like a cookie and not a cake. Yes, then has the filling. Mm-hmm. Okay. So next up we have truffles. Yay! It's a, let's see. It says silky smooth ganache. Um, so I'm looking forward to some regular old chocolate. Okay. Regular old, regular old chocolate. Mm -mm -mm. Oh. You gonna cut it? <laughs> no, have your own. Okay. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. That's good. The old chocolate. Mm. Nice welcome change to some of this other stuff mm -hmm. we've been eating. Mm, that's really good, very rich. It's good. Okay, so next up, we have chocolate cream Pandoro. Chocolate cream 
cream pantaloons. <laughs> It says Italy's beloved holiday sweet bread, which you like this kind of stuff. So it reminds me of panettone, but I don't know about the chocolate part of it. Oh, it's, I didn't see that. The, I didn't even realize I read it if I did. Gooey yeah. chocolate, did I read that? Well, yeah, it says um, Pandoro cake with chocolate cream, with cocoa yeah, it cream. Says gooey chocolate, this is something they celebrate or enjoy countrywide, I should say. I'm and I'm not really into the panettone. Okay, so basically I cut it into, it has the cocoa in the see. middle. Yeah. It smells like a Hawaiian sweet roll. Mm. Do you want the chocolate piece or the non-chocolate piece? Non-chocolate piece. Oh, okay. All right, so I guess I, I have to taste the chocolate since uh, someone of us has to. One of us has to. Cheers. Mmm. I like the I like the roll, the bread. It's just like Hawaiian bread, doesn't it? Like King's Hawaiian. That's exactly mm. what it tastes like to me. It's good. I like it. It is good. It is pretty good. Okay. So up next we have the apple and dark domino steins or domino. I think apple. it's domino steins. Um, no, I would not have expected apple. Mm -mm. So it says four layers of festive German deliciousness. It says it has a gingerbread base and then a layer of tart jelly and then a fluffy confection made of apricot kernels and then a coating of dark chocolate. Okay, this is what it looks like. I'll cut into it and see the inside. Okay. Huh? This is not, I've never heard of this before. Invented in 1936. Okay, long time ago, we weren't around. But look at that. Yeah, all the layers. Okay. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. Mmm. -mm. I like this too. Mmm. 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 -mm. Mm -mm. I taste like an almond type thing, which you don't like. Mmm. -hmm. Mmm. Oh, like it, it tastes like almond. I do not like it's good. almond flavoring. That's okay. So up next, oh, I can't even. I don't even want to swallow. <laughs> It's um, baklava from Jordan. And you really like baklava. I'm not a huge baklava fan. No, so inside this little container. Can I show them what the baklava is? Like? Yeah, oh yeah, but open it up and then there's um, on the inside. Several different types yeah. of baklava. Oh, I don't know, I'm st I still got that other one in my mouth. You're not having any of these? All right, I'll so. take one. Ooh, I'll try one. Oh, I gotta get that taste out. <laughs> All right, and I'll have one too. Cheers. Cheers. Good, good. What do you think? Mm. Well, I don't know if it's fair of me to say because I don't really care for baklava. It's not bad. It's not bad. Sweet. Yeah. Okay, so now we're gonna have some savory. We are having roasted garlic potato chips. All right, hopefully it's just potato chips with like I hope garlic. So. Uh, uh, it says um, it's a Czech tradition to place garlic beneath the holiday table. It's said to bring strength and protection to Ooh, everyone in attendance. This is a strong garlic scent. Oh, it smells good though. There's a lot of garlic. Cheers. Cheers. Oh. Too much garlic for me. Mmm. That's good. Ooh, I like it. You don't like it? All right. Initial hit was strong garlic. Got past it, got to the chip. It's not bad. <laughs> that was a very dramatic first response. <laughs> well, the garlic was strong. It is strong, but I like it. And it actually, the chip is not greasy like a traditional potato chip. It's very light. And the garlic flavor is really there, but it's not super salty. That's probably my favorite thing so far. Oh yeah. Yeah, Ooh. those are pretty good. Okay, so the I think the this is the last thing. one. So it is a sea salt and caramel fudge. It says a sweet and savory take on English Christmas fudge. This should um, be good. It should be, but I think it says. Uh, well, they're individually wrapped. Oh, they are. Yeah, individually wrapped in there. 
Uh, I'll try and cut it because. Yeah, it says uh, this is just not the traditional chocolate kind that you're used to. Um, so I'm excited to try this one. Okay. Okay. Cheers. Cheers. Like it? I like fudge though. I like fudge too. This is good. I don't taste the saltiness per se, mm. but I feel like I'm crunching on salt, like crystals. I didn't taste the salt, but that's good. No, that's fine. Mm. I think Not that's bad. it. Yeah, that is. That's it. Very interesting box. Very interesting box. So, some what was your? I like, what was your favorite? Oh, so I like I like this cake. I do. I like the. Uh, oh, I like a whole bunch of stuff. There's stuff I really don't like. This popcorn, really, and that uh, biscuit with the. Um, this one with the anise, no. Oh yeah, I forgot about that one. Mm -mm. So I would have to say that my favorite was probably those garlic chips. Mm -hmm. My least favorite, this licorice cookie thing. If you try the popcorn, that'd be up there too. <laughs> <laughs> this was terrible, this was terrible. Um, but all right, well that's it. I hope yeah. you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. If you have not subscribed to our channel, we certainly love to have you. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.